No one gives a shit. <laughs> what? No one gives a shit. No one, no one gives a shit. No gas podcast. No gas podcast. Bro, what are you talking about, man? No one gives a shit. No one, out, no one gives a shit. Hey, baby. Bitch. No. On this episode, we got Will Silvins and Kyle Grooms. These two comedians have been in the game for years. You've seen Will in Chris Rock's movie, Top 5. I was very excited to see you opening up for Chappelle. And he was most recently on The Breakfast Club promoting his Kickstarter campaign for a new movie he's working on called I Am Maurice. And he was roommates with the late, great, legendary comic Patrice O'Neill. My boy Kyle Grooms was in Amy Schumer's last movie, I Feel Pretty. And of course, you've seen him on The Chappelle Show. Just don't mention their resemblance to him or you might hear this. Hey, yo, shut the f- I recorded Kyle's comedy taping last November, and ever since then we've been working together to bring back a comedy scene here in Miami. I caught them both fresh off my Thursday night stage at Renee's in Wynwood, so they were still riffing. Also, local comics Manny Garavito and Rudy Wilson stopped by, and they call me the Latino Tarantino, and you're listening to No One Gives a Shit. Whenever you want to start a podcast, you let me know. I've been trying to get Kyle to do a podcast for ages. I know you did the hip hop, hip hop, right? That that, that, that hip hop suck. Oh, it didn't okay. suck, man. Do <laughs> you know the guests we had on that motherfucker, man? We had some. I mean, Pete had the, Davis he had the, na- was on. the neighbor. <laughs> he had the janitor from from Fish Street. <laughs> uh, the wackest ge- uh, guest we had was Will. To be honest, <laughs> I <with> was wack. <laughs> Kyle Grooms and Will Sylvain. It's called No Gas or yeah. No Guess? It's, no, No Gas. It's, uh, it's an acronym for No One Gives a Shit because I'm at that oh, level no, of my You career. know what I never knew what that no was? A, I yeah. mean, like, no one get like, we ain't gassing you up. Like, no gas over here. Cypher Sounds yeah. had a show called the, the, the Don't Get Gas comedy show you know cypher you know, yeah, sounds gas, don't get gas different yeah but well, he, well he's different. like no gas this is no gas this is, this is no one gives a well shit. well hold on so there's no gas don't get gas and who passed gas I, I don't that's know. A, your car that should be your show who passed who, 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 who passed who pass gas, gas. <laughs> yeah. podcast you know what there's something who, pa- like who passed gas podcast you talk about donald trump that idea stinks. <laughs> oh, <laughs> but <it> bones. <laughs> I like Cypher Sounds. He's a Chico like me. I was surprised well, I at his, his um, not surprised, but like it was, I was amazed or astounded to hear his uh, history with music and hip hop. Oh, yeah, and, yeah. Like all the people he like brought to the table that he worked with. That's yeah. like, Cypher Sounds has like so dope. many layers, man. Yeah, that's dope. Well, so I did, a sh- dope. I did a tour with, uh, with Chappelle. Yeah. Uh, and um, Cypher, so sometimes they would just have me come out, and then I had to warm the crowd up. And Don't but, some and, of his name but, drop. But then, <laughs> then Cypher sounds, he comes out because he he also do stand up and he does music and then he'll get the crowd hype, and then boom, he just get the crowd going, and be uh, and he's funny, and he, and he does he knows his music, yeah, he's chill, man. Yeah, yeah he, that dude works. <laughs> That was the um I think this is Manny. Put him on speakerphone. Okay. Hey Manny, what's up? I'm at the lobby. You're in the lobby? Why you sound like, like what's, a dope deal? Why you sound like it? Batman? Yeah, I'm in the lobby. <laughs> I'm, in, <laughs> I'm in the lobby. <laughs> tell Robin to tell Robin <laughs> to bust me in. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, this is Batman. Tell <laughs> tell, tell, tell commercial going, I can't my um my bat my bat cable is not working. I'm taking the elevator. <laughs> <laughs> Batman on the budget. <laughs> Hello, I'm at the bus station. <laughs> what bus do I take to to get to the Joker? <laughs> <laughs> Hello. <laughs> yeah, this is Batman. <laughs> yeah, um, <laughs> I got off the wrong stop. What floor? What floor? <laughs> yeah, Batman, what's Batman? What's wrong? I um. I took the I took the note forty six to twenty eight. No, I think I, I think I went too far. Is is the Joker still is the Joker still harassing people? <laughs> T- tell the Joker I'll be right there. <laughs> <laughs> Batman on the budget. <laughs> up just, up and to the bus. <laughs> <laughs> up up. Does uh, anybody got? Does anybody got the bus schedule? <laughs> <laughs> oh, <sorry. laughs> he sound creepy as shit. <laughs> My man Testing one, two. Manny Garavito, thank you for coming all late. All right, good to be here. But uh, all of y'all just Rudy, came up right now at, uh, at Trey's and Renee's. And uh, 
It was a good show. It, was, it wasn't as yeah, man. You was killing harder than I expected, man. I ain't seen oh, you on shit. stage in a Damn. minute. Yeah, you saw that. Should, yeah, I seen you. They kind of pulled back a little because of the diversity, I think. But I, you know, I think I landed the plane. Yeah, man. You was calm. You pulled back because of diversity. Jokes, I don't understand that. Jokes made. Oh, I think sense. when I went up, people kind of were like, "Well, the white guy is not as funny as the black dudes," and then kind of landed it. You it think that's why? You think that's that was people did. thinking? Shut up, Will. I know where you're going. <laughs> She's like, man, here comes a white guy. We're going to hear Yeah, this. that's usually how He's going to talk about down. Donald Trump think? and Wall Street and yeah. playing golf. Yeah, yeah, something like that. You think that's what black people are thinking, motherfuckers? I've been in urban crowds where they kind of immediately judge you if you're the only. All black people are thinking think? is like, he better not talk shit about me. That's yeah, all we so think. This about. nigga better be funny. I'm yeah. buying my drinks. Yeah. What the fuck? I think that's exactly yeah. what happens. Yeah. Nah, we don't give a fuck about you. And then you. all they like, man, I hope this funny. bitch give me some pussy. That's it. <laughs> Everybody uh, performed yesterday in Brickle. Everybody did good. It was a packed show yesterday. Uh, and now today, not so packed, but it was a nice little get Can together. Can you stop shitting on your room? That, that was a <laughs> yeah, good show. Yeah, it was a good turnout for a yeah, three-day promotion. Yeah, and yeah. it was live, man. Any crowd that laughed, man, it's live to me. I don't care if it was two yeah, or 2,000, man. It was live. We weren't talking to ourselves. That was yeah. a pretty good yeah, show, man. it was a man. great show, And the man. crowd was there was with it. They was with it. It's yeah. a decent place. The place was all very artful. It actually reminds sure. me of uh, the Boston Black. Comedy Club on like an off night. Like oh, yeah. Somebody's working out just so, to see Will up there. The we had the like DJ Black, Black, Black Snow. <laughs> <laughs> That's the first time you got his name right. Black Snow, right? <laughs> yeah, Black Snow. But it felt like we brought a little bit of New York vibe to Miami, to Wynwood, and you know that. Mm-hmm. And Renee's is a, a perfect spot to me just because of the history and the way, you know, it's just a chill place. But it's man, one of the, wait, what's Renee? Renee? What a big It's the difference. place where you performed. Oh, it's called Renee? <laughs> yeah. yeah, Renee's I know that. spot. Yeah, yeah, uh, Wynwood <laughs> spot. Oh. I thought it's called Black Snow. <laughs> 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 no, the DJ. You just bumped your teeth in the microphone? <laughs> this is why you can't uh, have his own podcast. <laughs> For people who can't, who can't see, <laughs> no, Kyle, the video. Kyle pulled back, the, the gold microphone f- fell on his teeth, on his Bugs Bunny teeth. <laughs> and made a thump sound. <laughs> I hit my chest. Uh, Will, why don't you have your own podcast? Oh, man, I don't know, man. It's like thousands of podcasts, hundreds of thousands of podcasts out there. Yeah, but not many, including not this ones. one, with the fame or clout. <laughs> yeah. Kyle, had a, Kyle had a podcast. Yeah, we talked yeah, about that yeah, before we you got here. That. Oh, he did. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we should get one, too. <laughs> but what about, what about you? Well, you yeah, yeah, you, why don't you get you, I know you, I know you I can't know. understand what the fuck I'm saying <laughs> podcast. <laughs> 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 and, we, uh, and we call rewind that again. Play that, right, run play that, that, that back. Run that back again. Rewind. <laughs> call it rewind. <laughs> <laughs> call it, that's a that's a good one. <laughs> rewind podcast. Will's, Will's, Will's weekly <laughs> rewind. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's a, I'm gonna keep that name. That's that's a keeper. I think it's a keeper. Now I don't know why you weekly we want. I know you putting all those W's in there. I don't I don't talk like that. You was just on a podcast that excelled everyone's expectations. The Chip Chipperson podcast. That's like the most popular. Oh one man, that dude out. funny as hell. Right? <laughs> Yeah, it's just and it's about nothing, man. He's just doing it. Th- th- this character just funny as shit. Yeah, and it just anything goes, man. Chip Chipperson's funny as shit. Anybody that do not know? Go check out Chip Chipperson's podcast. Jim Norton, After you check out this podcast, right? Yeah, no, don't skip right over it. But this is that's Jim Norton, man. Yeah, Jim Norton, funny as shit. How was it? How was it there? Because I saw that, and and you were uh, sitting next to the guy from O and A. Yeah, who who Patrice used to be on O and A all the time. Yeah, and they yeah. were good friends. Do you guys? Cool I don't know, but they were good friends. But they were, they were, you know, he, it was there for him to get. Patrice, the main thing was was to get his brand of comedy out, uh-huh. and that was the only place that was letting him do that. So he, that's where he went to wherever you get it where you fit in. You know what I'm saying? So, uh-huh. I mean, they they bounced off each other pretty well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Patrice seemed like he wasn't really uptight about the race thing. Too much, I guess. Being from Boston, that yeah, was kinda, Boston's super racist. Yeah, yeah. So, how did you feel like being there? Oh yeah, I was chill, man. I mean, yeah. you know, I'm, I'm, I don't mind. I get along with anybody. Okay. All right. Cool. I, I feel like if you're racist, you have the right to be racist. You know, I think, I think, um, black people or any people of color, you put your money with them out. You know, like don't support these businesses or. You know, you feel you feel like you're not they're not you're not being appreciative or they're not supporting your community or they you they they looking down you don't 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 shop there don't you know don't put your money there you know put the money back in our own pockets recycling. No one gives a what? shit. No one gives a shit. No one no one gives a shit. Nah.
No gas. Podcast. Bro, what are you talking about, man? No one gives a shit. No one gives a shit.